Just call me Santa, bitch, okay? You get a gift. You get a gift. You get a gift. I might start back wearing foundation for the rest of the uh, winter because, like, the face is eating. It was never me. I was never the problem. If you new to the channel, welcome. If you're not, what's good? What's going on? Okay, y'all. So today is Friday. I'm really happy. I didn't have to wake up. I like I needed to sleep in. When I tell y'all, it was so hard for me to get up every day this week. I needed to sleep in. Okay, I needed to. And y'all, I totally forgot I had a training schedule at the gym today at ten. I literally forgot. I literally forgot. I had to text the girl and was like, we need to reschedule. But she told me that she, like, if I came in today, I would be with somebody else anyway because she got the flu. And I was like, girl, let's just reschedule because I don't want to do it with nobody else because the other one person was a boy and I don't want to do that. So, um, we're not doing that today, sadly. But it's okay. I told y'all, like, I'm going to get in the gym on my own terms. I feel like I was forcing myself to do so. You know what I'm saying? Like, it is what it is. But, like, I'm going to reschedule and I'm going to go. So, the first thing on today's schedule is we need to desperately get this hair done. So, I need to wash my hair because I'm pretty sure it's a little bit matted up. It's been in the same braids for I don't know how long. I told myself I wasn't doing this shit no more. But, I got to wash my hair. I need to redo this um, wig collab that I've been supposed to do, y'all. So, we're going to get it done today. Child, the wig is already worn out. This is the wig I had on for a uh, vacay. I just got to do a styling video. So, I'm thinking about doing... I'm going to show y'all whatever I end up doing. So, there's that. And then after that, um, I need to go to, like, the store. I just need to go to Target or possibly the mall just to finish up my Christmas shopping. Because I got, like, a couple more things to get. And then I'll be done. And I feel like I could just go ahead and get it done today or whatever. And what else I needed to do? I don't know. I think that's really it. But, like, knowing me, that stuff is going to take all day. So, I really need to get to it. But I got to do my hair and my makeup. Um, before I like do anything so with it being like 10 o'clock I don't want to be done with that by how about I say 12 girl Ooh, I don't know 1 30 at the latest 1 30 at the latest I feel like I can have that done and I can get dressed and leave the house and we'll just figure out like what did they take us or whatever so that's what we're gonna do I ended up um because I was telling y'all about like the presents and stuff I ended up digging in my closet right here I still got wrapping paper from last year but that's definitely not enough so I need to go get some more um and then like these are all the gifts that i got so far sitting over here in the corner bro that right there is for me that's that's for me right there because <laughs> y'all had to buy myself something but um i also got some fashion nova coming in today and then i got some miss lola coming in i think monday so i got a couple of things i'm trying to hurry up like if the fashion nova comes today then i could probably go ahead and get the haul done so i'm hoping that it just hurry up like it says off for delivery but y'all know how they go so and I still never wore this purse. Like, it just been sitting here. I did, and that's why I haven't worn it. Because it been sitting in the living room. Like, if I put it in my closet, I'll be able to see it. But I don't know what the word is with. I got to see. Or I got to see what I can do with this. Girl, can y'all see the mirror? I don't know. I got to see. But let's go ahead and wash this head run. She don't understand. He holds it down for my father. And the makeup is done. Period. But y'all, I'm having a really hard time so y'all know when i first put the wig on i showed y'all that it was like doing the ripple effect in the front of it and i thought it was me but no it's the wig like no matter how like straight i tried to put the wig like i could lay it down like i'm laying it down boom it's like it's coming back up like it's the way the wig is and i saw some tiktoks and they say when a wig does this it's not Basically, it's not made properly, so it won't lay no matter what I do to it. So, like, I try to tighten it up in the back and everything, and it's just nothing is working. So, like, I'm trying to figure out a hairstyle that I could do that could just cover up this front part. It's so crazy. I look like I didn't even pluck this damn wig, and I did. That's crazy. <sighs> I don't know. I just need to do something quick just so I can get this collab out the way. I'm thinking, like, 
bangs <laughs> bitch i don't know have anybody ever did like bangs on like curly long hair because they don't want me to cut like the hair at all i don't think but bitch i'm gonna have to do a bang or something and i didn't even re use real glue i used this just because i wanted it to be quick because i plan on like putting on something another wig damn this uh, the hairstyle i wanted to do was like i wanted to do like a middle part with two little bun buns but i don't think i'm gonna be able to do that Oh my, I don't know. Let's see. Let's try to put like some more glue up here and see like if that lays it down. But I really doubt it. I really doubt it. And I hate using this. I remember why for a fact I stopped using this. It's the most, ugh. Like it's so, ugh. It's so slimy and I don't like it. Look at it. About to drip off the comb. Uh, let's try this. I don't know if this don't work child we're gonna figure something out so we can get this damn collab done and um since i don't have no lashes on i'm thinking about just doing that other lash collab i got they sent me some lashes that don't need glue so like you really supposed to just put them on straight out the pack so we'll see how that goes as well oh i didn't uh it's 12 o'clock so i mean honestly i would have been on good timing if this wouldn't have happened look at it rippling up ah! you know what i don't care i don't care I don't care. Might have to do one of them little swoop bangs. Y'all know the bangs that come like that. I might have to do that, y'all. Because it just... Let me show y'all. I don't know if y'all can really see what I'm talking about. Y'all see that? No matter what I do to put it down, it's not going to stay. It was never me. I was never the problem. I know what the fuck I'm doing when it comes to these wigs. Uh, what company is this? I don't even know. I've worked with them before and this never happened. So I don't want to like downplay the company because I think it's truly just this wig. Because I've worked with that company a couple of times. But what hairstyle can I do? Like I literally don't even know now because what the freak? So it's given like one of these. It's given one of these. <laughs> I don't like that, but I don't know what else to do. I'll come back once I figure it out because I gotta get this done. I'm ready to get my day started for real. My man is my man is your man, her, that's her man. I just keep them satisfied through the weekend. Oh child, I don't know. What's the giving? I don't like these. <laughs> they're not they're cuter on this camera than this camera, but also I this camera is further away, so maybe I just can't see. And the lace is fucked. You know what I'm saying? But for the lighting, like the, the let me tell you one thing about lace. If you're in good, 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 good lighting and it's bright enough, it'll camouflage it out. So I feel like the video is is straight. Like you can't tell the lace is lifting for real because I'm so far back. But it, it's ate up. It's ate up. <laughs> but I made something shake. As y'all can see, I didn't really. I did the size a little bit as much as I could, child. I don't know. I'm trying to think about if I want to wet the hair or not. I'm really. Don't think that i should i think i should just really leave it like this i don't know if i like these i think that's the problem now that's the problem that i'm facing and they're not the same i want them to be exactly the same i'm one of those people that like everything like asymmetrical like perfect and these are not doing that for me i don't know this is the update though y'all know it's um it's it's a one it's, it's 12 44 so i'm really still doing great time and so i really just need to hurry up and, and keep it going now that's what I call a productive morning. Make some noise, y'all. What the fuck? Bitch, I done did my hair. It's a little, you know, up close. It's crazy, but <laughs> Rebecca is cute. And I did these lashes, y'all. These are some, um, I ain't getting paid for this one, but I'm getting paid for TikTok, but I'm gonna still put y'all on. Anyway, it's from um, B&Q. They are like lashes that you don't even have to use glue to put them on. Like you literally just stick them on. I did the review on TikTok, so go watch it on there. But, like, they're on. Like, they're not coming off unless, like, if you pull them, they're going to come off, clearly. But if you need, like, a little one-two, just a little. Shit, these are good for content. Like, literally, I'm going to wear these just for content purposes. Like, something I could easily put on and take off, like. Okay, ooh, that could be a selling point in the video that I'm about to do. Because I'm going to do a voiceover. I didn't feel like talking or whatever, but. Okay, so I'm trying to now figure out. It's 1.05. My uh, fashion over just got here. So I'm trying to figure out if I want to go ahead and do the haul. Because it's like, I'm cute. My hair done. Lashes on. Do I want to do the haul? Do I want to do the haul? I don't know. I don't know. 
I don't want to overwhelm myself because that's one thing I do do. But I, I'm like, I'm I'm good. You know what I'm saying? I, I feel like I could get it done. So let me go get the clothes and see, like, you know. You know, I'm going to get, yeah. So let's, let's see. But then again, I don't know. Should I just do that tomorrow? Because I'm doing my makeup again tomorrow because we're having a girls night and I want to be cute. Because I really do want to go to the store today. Or should I just go to the store tomorrow? Because I could go to the store tomorrow. I don't know. I think I could do that. I could think I think I'm going to go to the store tomorrow, but like wake up and go. You know what I'm saying? Like get up and go to the store. Cause I feel like right now I'ma catch like work traffic and all of that. Yep. I think I just talked myself into like making a, a better decision, which is getting up in the morning, I'm gonna wake up like nine, ten, head to the stores and do all the rest of my shopping that I need to do. And that's gonna be a wrap. So let me go ahead and get this haul done while I got the momentum to get it done, okay? I'm watching Bianca graduation. I went on my bitch to cross that stage. Period. Mm -hmm. Vincent J. Eigelhart. Bianca Sierra Asinho. <laughs> Y'all see? Y'all want to fucking see? I'm on that motherfucking stage. Ah! That is so crazy, bro. We. <laughs> my bitch really out here getting to it. Stop laying with her. The big one, not the little one. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So, y'all see, we got the setup going. I got my lights on. Let me turn my lights on. Lights on, lights on. We about to go ahead and get this damn show on the road. God damn, that shit bright. All right, so we're going to do the hard light this right here. So, let's go ahead and hop right in. I really don't want to take too long doing this. I really want to get in, get out, be done. So, let's, let's, let's do it. Let's do it. And that's a motherfucking wrap. Hey, hey, we got that done really fast. I'm proud of myself because when it comes to these hauls, I already I get y'all this feel every time. I be nervous. I don't know why. I just be nervous. But I can't wait to get up out of these clothes baby, because these pants about to take me out. These are the size I always get, but baby, these, <laughs> these are a little tight. I don't know if I'm I don't know if I'm gonna keep them. Cause girl. But anyways, um, I'm about to like shower up and stuff because I, I started sweating a little bit. And I did I tell y'all? I think I'm about to go get a tattoo. So let me let my camera charge up and you know while I get ready and stuff, and then me and Ebony hanging out after that. Alright, ladies and gents, we are ready. I just want a black um what is this called, girl? A black crop hoodie that I got from HM. Some flare leggings that I got from Fashion Nova. And then my, um, what are these called? My foam runners. My friends bought me like two Christmases ago. And I put on this bag, um, Bottega Duke that I got from Forever 21. And I also made me a smoothie before we leave the house. Just because I needed to put something on my stomach. I woke up, I ate sausage, and then after that I ate them little egg roll things that I had bought. I finished those off before I did my, um, I was about to say collab. Before I did the haul video, so this is just like the hold me over until I get with Ebony and we go get some more food or something. So yeah, it was pretty good. I've been making the best smoothies at home. Like, let's really get into it. I'm really kind of nervous about going out with my hair like this because up close it's not cute at all. But from afar it's really cute. Uh, I said I was going to bring a hat as backup with me. I don't know. It's like if I'm going to do it, just do it. Fuck it. Like, it is what it is. Like, bitch, my hair be done. But I don't want nobody to catch me. <laughs> I don't want to catch me on all day. Like, damn, y'all said that bitch big. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Let me, I'm going to grab a hat just in case. But, um, yeah, we're about to go ahead and head out so I can have somebody tattoo. I am about to say appointment, but it's really not even an appointment. I still have yet to really know what I'm going to get. So, let's see when we get there. All right, y'all, we in the car. We on the way um, to go to the um, tattoo shop. And it is so crazy outside today. Like, it's so much traffic literally everywhere. But anyways, y'all, I was on TikTok, um, like, before I was leaving the house. And all of my whole timeline is about Raymonte going on Ari and them cooking uh, show. And I told y'all last night that I wanted to watch it because I thought it was going to be so funny. Y'all, I am not going to lie. Like, everybody who's making videos about it is, like, it's right. Like, it gave, like... I don't even understand why they invited him on the show if they was going to act like that with him. Like, when I say it was kind of cringy for me to watch the whole entire time because it just kind of felt like they was tolerating him. Like, they didn't really want him to be there. He was the only person just kind of, like, 
being himself and being just like funny and just being himself you know what i'm saying if you know Monte, if you follow him you know he's he's you know like he's extra that's just him as a person he came being 100 percent himself he was he opened up you know what i'm saying and they was acting so stink especially tucson i thought at first i thought it was like you know a little kiki between them two but tucson was really acting real fucking stink i don't understand that because tucson you you really would be nobody if it wasn't for the people who you be with like you know what i'm saying like you cannot act like that because honestly ray Monte might have more notoriety than him so i don't know why he was acting stink with him and then ari was just acting uninterested you know what i'm saying like i don't i don't really know what like, that's my opinion it just felt like uh, it was so like uh to watch and i just felt kind of bad like he I don't know, but everybody on the um, TikTok is basically saying, like, they was wrong for that. Ray Monte was, you know, like, he was just being himself. He shouldn't feel no kind of way about it. I don't know if he made a video first and everybody just, like, you know, telling him, like, don't worry about it. Because I haven't seen his video, but I just keep seeing people basically telling him, like, you was being yourself. Like, you're good. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's the videos that everybody's making, so... I'm gonna have to see if he had when he made a video, but yeah, it was so cringy. I feel like don't invite nobody on your show, like strictly for views or some shit. I don't know, you know what I'm saying? Because he's popping right now, if you ask me. Like, yeah, he came about on TikTok, but how did they come about? You know what I'm saying? Like, one of them came about from messing with a rapper, and the other one is just from being a hairstylist friend. Like, you, you get what I'm saying? Like, they kind of came, like, his come up was organic, like, he all him. They come up so wasn't that. So it's like you just uh even though y'all is in different tax brackets, like it just weird. It be weird energy. And it's like you never really know. Um, cause we wasn't there, so you don't really hundred percent know how it was, but they cut the video up so much that by half of the video I didn't even want to watch it no more because they kept cutting the video. Like whenever they would start like playing the game or they'll cut the video and now they're doing something else, and it's like they cut so much of the video, you could tell that the video was supposed to be way longer than it was, how much they kept cutting the video. So that was like, uh, like I wonder what they was cutting out. I don't really know. But yeah, it was it was cringy to watch, if you ask me. It was real cringy. But I just hope he continues to grow and continue to like get in other rooms. Like I feel like, yeah, keep me in his 100% self. But, like, you know, I, I pray that, you know, he probably get a little bit better, a little bit more professional so he can step into different rooms because he is, he's an entertainer, okay? He's going to entertain the people. You know what I'm saying? Like, like every one of his videos be a hit. Every last one of them. So, I don't know. That's what I had to say about it, chair. Yeah. What y'all think? What y'all think about it? The makeup is given today, though, y'all. Like, I have on foundation. I haven't worn foundation for real, for real. Well, I wore some for the shoot. But, like, I might start back wearing foundation for the rest of the uh, winter because, like, the face is eating. It's giving, like, full beat, for real. It's so cute, and I overline my lips. So, it's giving lip injections, which is giving that. It's so cute, okay? I'm feeling myself today. If only the hair was just in line. I'm still a bad beat, though, you know, from a distance. Up close, I don't know what is this? You know, yeah, period. Don't play with her. Don't play with her. <laughs> oh, let me vibe out to my music though until I get the child. Cause y'all know one thing about this camera is gonna die. So I want it to be fully charged when we get there. Okay, I don't know what to get. So I'm trying to see what word I'm on. I still don't even know what side though. Cause okay, you see I got this tattoo right here. Mm. I don't know. I guess it really don't matter because you can't see it for real unless like my hair probably showed its hair. I don't know. Maybe this side, I guess. Is it? This side. Okay, I don't know. I feel like I wanted to get it on this side, cause the um, like this is my like my right side is my like side, but I already got this tattoo, so I don't really know. Okay. Yeah. That one. It's too long. Yeah, that one. Not cute. Yeah, I like the first one. This one we can go with, y'all. See? Oh, I can see a little bit. Yeah, you probably want to take a picture because I can't really. I can see, but I can't see. Um, yeah, we can bring it down just a little bit. Like, maybe to, like, right here, maybe. Yeah.
we're all done. Can y'all see it? <laughs> oh my goodness, I really got a fucking tattoo right here. I really want one right here. Feel good, she, you know. They playing too much music in here, I'ma come back. Real street, bitch, I know these hoes ain't fucking with me. Go sexy, go sexy, go sexy. <laughs> I just made that TikTok, but um, I don't know, can y'all see? This is what it looked like. I don't want to take this off just yet because I just don't. Let me show y'all a picture that the boy took. Child, and it's so crazy, y'all. My lace was all over my ear. He wrong for that. He could have told me, like, damn, put the lace behind your ear a little bit. I told y'all, like, I half ass did the wig. So it was just, you know, I wasn't on that right. But can y'all see? Look at it. So freaking cute. And I ended up getting the word persistence just because, like, Every time I thought about getting a tattoo that was just like one word, that's the only word that I could like ever think of like to get. And like, I just feel like it describes so many things. Like it's so many things, you know, that I could correlate it to. Cause I was going to change it to like faith, but I didn't want to be like real cliche and get that. You know what I'm saying? But you know, I've been real big in my faith these days, but I just wanted to get something else. And persistence was the word that just kept popping in my head, popping in my head because I think, like, when it comes to, like, anything in my life, I've just always been super persistent with it. Even when I felt like it wasn't going well for me, I just kept, I kept pushing it. Like, I kept pushing it. If it's something that I wanted to do or wanted, like, I just kept pushing it until I was able to get there. So, like, all aspects of life. So, school, made it through the, hell, tried to go to law school. I was real persistent with that, even though it didn't work out for me. Like, I told you, I took that test umpteen amount of times. Um, I'm persistent in my, in my faith. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, I'm constantly trying to get better when it comes to, like, getting, like, a, my relationship to be stronger with God. So, I'm really consistent with that um, or persistent with that. Um, let's see. Shoot, YouTube, I feel like, oh, I should be bigger than what I am. But even when I feel like a lot of my videos should do better than they do, like, on any of my platforms or, you know, any any other, like, thing I put out that I feel like should get more views, more likes, blah, blah, blah. Even though it doesn't, I'm still persistent. I'm still going to keep going. So I just felt like persistence was just, like, perfect. So, and that's what I'm going to continue to do. Like, we're going to keep going. Like, if it's something that I want, I'm going to continue to keep doing it and doing it and doing it. Unless God, like, just tell me, like, okay, no, this ain't it. Let's try this route. You know? But other than that, I'm going to be persistent in it because I believe in myself and I believe I can get stuff done. But on the other hand, it's just cute as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just giving real... It's not really, like... It's kind of like your neck because it stops, like, right here and it comes down to my neck. He was going to have it start, like, right here, but I'm like, no, bring it down some because I wanted to give neck action... I slick would have got it all the way down here, but I'm like, nah, that's too deep. I don't know. I like it, though. I feel like it's perfect. Honestly, I could have really went full throttle neck, and it wouldn't have been too bad, but maybe I'm saying it because my hair really big right now. You really can't tell. I feel like the only time you'll be able to see this is if I do, like, a bob or something, or if I got, like, you know, purposely trying to show it, but real cute. Ebony was like, girl, you're going to be trying to go back and get another tattoo real soon. I'm like, no, nah, not really. Like, I'm not one of those, like. In between every tattoo that I've got, I've waited like over a year. Like, I've I've always waited a long time, but I do say I want like two or three more tattoos, maybe like two or three, and I'm gonna be done. Cause I don't really see myself getting it, and it's like there's nothing that I just really really want. I used to want a butterfly on my butt, not like the two big but no, not like that. But I used to want like one big butterfly on my right cheek. I don't know. I just kind of grew out of that. I don't really want that no more. Um, I used to want a sleeve, but I just feel like I'm not going to want that for the rest of my life. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not going to, I'm not going to want that for the rest of my life. So I just been getting small stuff. Like the biggest thing that I probably have is this rose down the middle of my chest. And I'm not going to lie. At one point I, oh, excuse me. I was wishing that I didn't get it. I was wishing that I didn't, didn't get it. I was like, Coming up with a game plan of like when I turn like 35, I'm gonna get it removed. But that's when I had first got it. I was in kind of like a crisis of like, why did I do this to my body? Like, I was having one of those moments, but now I really love it. And I just realized like, life doesn't always have to be so serious. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, people, I can't stand those people who like, don't get a tattoo if it don't mean nothing. While this does mean something to me, I also just thought that thought it was cute. 
Like, I'm not gonna lie. I thought about just getting butterflies back here, but I felt like that was too basic, so I didn't get it. But, like, I'm one of those people I'm gonna get a tattoo because I think it's cute. Like, I definitely got this one right here. Okay, y'all see? Because I thought it was cute. Like, so I feel like life is so short. Like, enjoy it. Like, if you want to get tatted the fuck up, do it. You know, enjoy yourself. But anyways, I'm over here waiting on Ebony to tell me when she ready. So we can go ahead and go. We're going to go to Modish tonight. And I've been there a couple of times. And we're just going to eat, drink, hookah, and vibe out and, you know, chill. Hopefully there's some niggas there. Because, you know, I need to... I need to get the roster up. I need to... Where the niggas at? Damn. Hopefully they the... But yeah, I'm just ready to get out this house. So I'm just sitting here waiting on her. Because she had went somewhere beforehand. And she was waiting on me. And then I ended up waiting on her. Oh, she just texted me. She said, walk in now, baby. Let's go. I'm not uh, vlogging my phone. I'm not taking my camera with me. Mainly because I don't feel like... I don't feel like holding it. And I'm just want to, like, you know, be free. So it's going to probably be a little montage anyway. So, see you guys once I get there. Oh, shit. Y'all, please look at him. He is tearing it the fuck up. Oh, my God. Damn, y'all missed it. He was showing out bad. Like, he was doing really, really... Like, he was killing it. Like, I don't know if he homeless or what, but I I love it. Like, you dancing. You enjoying your life. Like, you, you still... You know? <laughs> Okay, as you guys can see, we are vibing out to the weekend. And y'all, I don't know why, but last night I started listening to the weekend while I was in the shower. I'm like, I haven't listened to the weekend in a minute. Like, I was just feeling the vibes. And, like, I was listening to it, and, like, I was in, like, really deep thought. Because, like, for me, the weekend, my weekend era was when I was in high school. That's when he was, like, dropping the hits back to back to back. Like, for me, I used to listen to albums. I was never a girl who listened to a song. So, anytime he dropped, I would listen to everything. Like, everything. And I knew everything. I know all the words, all that. And, like, I feel like my friends were so different from me because I always kind of like alternative music. And they always wanted to hear, like, the hood rat right shit. So, like, I really used to, like, deep dive into The weekend and really, like, listen to him. When I say, like, looking back on that time of my life, I was really depressed in high school. Like, I would listen to The weekend and I would just feel like I understood him so well. Like, I don't know how. Like, I just really felt like I understood him so well. I would literally be in my room, like, with the lights out. I would just listen to The weekend and vibe out and just just be in my own feels like, like i know my mama probably used to be like what the fuck is wrong with this bitch like i really used to vibe out to the weekend like i used to be in my weekend bag but like it just bring back a lot of memories of like wow i was really listening to this shit in high school like that's that's really crazy but um yo so today let's get into the fit today we're wearing a h m little cropped hoodie that i got who knows when um these sweatpants that jerley she sent over in that haul a uh, Mia Coppola beanie and I got on my Uggs to match it and I'm gonna put on that purse I had on last night so y'all we had a late start to the day okay we had a very late start to our day it is 12 39 I didn't wake up till 11 o'clock I, I sat in the bed till 12 got in the shower I literally just finished getting ready so like I don't know. I thought I was gonna wake up early today. I don't know if it was the lick. I really didn't drink for real. I had a drink and this boy had got me two shots. That's all I had. And I really wasn't even lit for real last night. I was feeling a little tipsy, but like I don't know. I couldn't wake up this morning for some reason. So 
got up late so now we're about to go ahead i'm trying to figure out i told myself i wanted to go to the mall but y'all know i don't do the mall on saturday something about the mall on saturdays don't do it for me i don't know about that so i'm thinking about just going to target and then going to atlantic station because atlantic station is kind of like the mall they have everything that i need there which is forever 21 h and m um Sephora they got everything I need so um I'm just gonna do that and they right next to each other so yeah that's what we're gonna do I have to I have made me a whole list of stuff that I need to get from Target so many like gift cards for Christmas and then the rest of the stuff for the game because I told y'all we having a girls night so I gotta get that stuff and then I wanted to go to Sephora to use my gift card because I really wanted to buy me some perfume I was really gonna buy it myself and then like I was like I got a motherfucking gift card because Sephora perfume is 20% off, so I'm hoping that they have the one that I want. Because I've been wanting this perfume for over a year now, and I just never bought it because it's just so fucking high. So, that's the plan. So, let's go ahead and go. I think I'm probably going to stop at, like, Starbucks or Dunkin' because I really want Starbucks. I'm going to go to Starbucks since it's in Target because I really want a refresher, like, after this taste that I already. Should I eat at home? No, we're just going to eat at Starbucks as well. Let's go. We're going to burn this. We're in a money spending mood today. Now, this is exactly why I should have got my ass up. Target is booming like the club, y'all. When I tell y'all, it's no parking spots, none. Not even in a far back. Everybody is circling around 20,000 times to find a spot, bro. I cannot stand this. I'm really annoyed. Oh! Like, it's so packed, y'all. Like, it's ridiculous. Oh, 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 oh. Did I find one? Is you coming out or what? I done rode around 10 times, y'all. And it's like, I could just go ahead and go to Atlantic Station first. But I feel like it's about to be packed over there, too, for number one. And for number two, I want to get my refresher first. But that only means that Starbucks is packed as hell as well. <laughs> what the... Oh! All right, let's see what Starbucks is giving, child. Ah, oh, damn. Shit. Guess we have to wait in line. It really ain't that bad though. All right, so this is the list that we working with right now. So first on the list is cotton balls. Oh, and I need satin spray. But I don't want to got my Starbucks. They need not to have people working there if they don't fully train them. And I got this loud ass basket. I always get the loud one. But like the girl that messed up my order had to reorder and everything. Like girl. And I hate being like rude. But I had told the girl what I wanted like five times. Because she kept asking. And you still ain't get it right? Alright we got the setting spray. What else I need? Alright we looking for a baby doll. This is cute. But I think her mama gonna kill me. This say cry baby. So I'm assuming they just cry all day. They got all of these. I don't know what to buy kids. Just, I don't got none. They got baby alive, girl. Sixty dollars. What the fuck? Girl, by the time y'all see this video, I know it's probably gonna be too late. But make make sure y'all go Christmas shopping as soon as possible. I'm talking November because it's crazy out here in these streets. Like it is so packed. It's it's insane girl people about the people arguing and all that i'm not about to do all that with y'all y'all need to mm -mm, mm -mm. but we at um atlantic station as y'all probably could tell i'm about to go to h m get some gift cards and sephora and that's really only only the places i need to go but i might hit one or two more places just to see what they got because y'all know me how to put Gotta put these fingers on something for myself, okay? But shopping is going really well. Just call me Santa, bitch, okay? You get a gift. You get a gift. You get a gift, okay? Period. Oh, it's packed out here. They always got something going on. It smells good, too. I ain't really ate today. They didn't have no food at Starbucks, so I'm gonna have to see what I can get or whatever. Oh, y'all, look at the ice skating. I won't be doing that shit again. I was tired as hell, but it looks fun. It's a workout. Girl, okay. You like to put the red one better than this? Yes, the red one is cuter. I'm on the phone with Kmo. We're trying to find our child um something an outfit to wear to go see Santa or whatever. 
I done blew a motherfucking bag. Oh, I forgot I went in Forever 21 and bought something too. I, I forgot to add that in there. Okay, guys, so we are low key done shopping, not for real, but low key, low key, low key. I'm ready to go home. I'm gonna do like a big haul of everything that I got once I get home, but right now I'm at Blaze Pizza. Yep, yep. Focus. Okay, so we're at Blaze. I'm about to go get me a little pizza pizza. And I'm just gonna um eat that when I get home. I did wanna go like eat, like take myself out to eat, but it's so busy out here in this in Atlanta. Like I just don't wanna go nowhere. I want to get something, but I didn't want like fast, fast food, so I decided to come here and I'm gonna um, you know, eat at home. I need to do a hair collab. I don't know, I may keep this wig on or do the hair collab. I don't know yet. Um, the girls' night starts at 8. I got everything I need for that. So we're good on tonight. I think I'm going to pop outside tomorrow to do the rest of my little last-minute shopping. I didn't end up getting my um, perfume from Sephora because... I don't know. It's crazy how, like, I wanted that perfume so, so bad. But, like, like I sprayed it on me. And I don't, I'm not, like, the big... Like, I like it. But I'm not, like, the biggest fan of it to where I just want to spend that much money on it. Like I said, it's 160 It was 20% off, but that ain't nothing. That ain't nothing. So I feel like I'm going to use my gift card on stuff that I really, really want. So I'm probably just going to go back and either get makeup stuff or I might give me a perfume. I don't know. I really don't know yet. I didn't want, also, I didn't want to rush in there because, like, like I said, it's a lot of people out. And I really want to go in there and take my time, so... There's that on that. But let me go ahead and get my pizza and then I'm going to show you everything I got once I get um in the house. Oh, my phone on 1%. Let me put that down. All right, let's get into a haul of everything that I had got. But y'all, first and foremost, I didn't did this haul yesterday. The clothes still sitting right here for number one. But for number two, I forgot that I had two orders from Shein. So I have a whole, I have like, 12 other items on the way from Shein that I did not put into that haul. So, I'm I'm just going to make it its own haul at this point. I might just add a couple more things just to make it a bigger haul. Because, like, how did I forget about that? Anyways, I ordered some purses from Miss Lola. Those came today, so let's get into them. This is so freaking cute. I bought this purse to go with them silver boots that I got. I have, like, three other silver bags, but they're not, like, I don't know. They're just, like, handbags. Like, I can't, like, over-the-shoulder them or, like, cross-body them. So, we got this. I think this is really freaking cute. Like, get into the details. It, it, oh, it's really giving a mirror. Okay, that's the first bag, and then I got another bag. I didn't even show y'all the shoes that I got from Miss Lola. Did I? I don't think I did. Maybe I'll show y'all those, too. I feel like I'm hell. These is my Christmas presents, low key for myself. And then I'm pretty sure you guys know about this clear bag. Isn't she so pretty? I can't wait to wear this. It comes with a strap, but I don't see myself wearing it with the strap. I just see myself wearing it just normal. I can't wait to put like some like aesthetically pleasing stuff inside of here. Oh, how do I? Open? Okay, there it is. Let's take this chain off first and foremost. I don't like that. Let's see what my phone look like. Girl, can the phone fit? Girl, can the phone fit in that girl? I think it can. Oh, okay. Y'all see my phone with the silver? This is cute. I can't wait to wear it. It's bigger than I thought it would be. Let me get the shoes so I can show y'all the shoes. Oh, so I ended up buying two pairs of shoes from there as well. And these are the boots. Like, let's get into it. These are some bad bitch boots, okay? Like, bad bitch i love these like they're different and i was a little hesitant about getting them but i think that they're super cute they're gonna be really cute on because i tried them on and then i don't know why i bought these y'all i just got them like i don't think they was that much money and i feel like i don't have just like a cute little elegant shoe so i got these i hope y'all can see is the lighting even good like i don't know but yeah got these thought they were super cute so that's everything i got from miss lola now let's get into all the stuff that I got for these sure. I hope, um, they don't watch my channel like that anyway, though. So, I got this set for my sister, girl, because she's obsessed with nails, okay? 
I got this Barbie doll for my little cousin Riley. Ciao. I'm not gonna lie, I had like a moment in Target where I was kind of pissed off because I'm looking for baby dolls and none of them is black. Like, none of them is black. And the ones that are black didn't look black. Like, it was giving, like, what is this? You know what I'm saying? Like, uh uh, I don't like that. We need, they need to get on it. I don't know if they, the, all the black ones were sold out or what, but the one that I did see that was black, it was like black, black. Like, bitch, like black, black. Like, like black. And I'm like, ain't no way. Ain't no way. But that's neither here nor there. Okay. For my godchild, I ended up getting this. It's like a, what did it say? It's just like three months and up. And it's like a sensory toy, teething toy and all that. Because I don't really know what to get him. I already got him a gift card so his mama could buy him some clothes whenever she needs to. And, um, yeah. And I'm supposed to be buying him some bottles and stuff. But I didn't see none today. So, I'm going to go back out and get that. I think that's it as far as the kids gifts go. I don't know if I showed y'all all the other stuff that I bought, but I bought my sister all type of stuff. Like the girl got, I don't, I don't even know how much money I spent on, on her at this point. But um, I got this little perfume set, Juicy Couture. This is like one of my OG faves. Um, me and like my family, like my cousin two house, I be going to. We pull names, so um, I ended up getting this for her. I feel like you can't go wrong with perfume. And then I needed cotton balls for the game. Y'all know about that. I needed some new towels, string for one of the games. I needed some setting spray, and this has been, like, my go-to. Like, I steered away from it, but as soon as I made my way back, I'm like, yes, this is the one I needed. So I had to re-up on that. And then I got the uh, new Prosecco from Issa Rae. I'm so excited about this because I've been seeing it on everybody's, like, vlogs and tiktoks and that they was trying it i heard like it, it really wasn't like the best but when it comes to prosecco like prosecco isn't sweet it's not like a you know what i'm saying like but it's good so i see myself drinking this with some mimosas but honestly i just wanted it just to have it like <laughs> am i gonna even open her up i don't know it's just so freaking cute and i love me some easter ray okay i'm gonna support my girl down every time period um H&M I just got a gift card so I got my sister a gift card and I got my little cousin a gift card and then because I, I the, the parents could buy the clothes on their own I'm not buying nothing I'm not doing all that okay and then lastly um me so did I only buy myself one thing today for real for real I guess so yeah I guess you know clothing wise but um this was $25 but the whole forever 21 was 50% off y'all I really didn't even notice that until I got up to the register and if I would have knew that I would have picked up way more stuff so I might have to go back tomorrow and see what they got but um it's just like a little regular you know I feel like I just needed it because I got a black one like this and then you know I just needed a gray one so I was like let me just get it it's a little crop hoodie I feel like I had got something else what am I missing here I really don't know I think that's it. I think that's all the stuff that I got. So, let me... I don't know what I'm about to do. I was about to wrap gifts, but I really don't have the... I just bit my damn tongue. I really don't have the time to do so because I'm really debating on doing a wig collab. Like, I don't want to, but I feel like I should. And the girls night started at 8. It's probably be like 5 o'clock. Which is more than enough time for me to do it. But it's like, do I... Maybe I should just do it. Stop thinking about it. Because that's what hold me back. When I think about it too hard, I'm like, oh, no. I'm just doing it. <laughs> like, just do it. You know? So, I don't know. I'll figure out what I'm about to do. And I'm just come back to y'all once I have that figured out. So, let me just clear this up. Because I just made a whole mess. We're getting all this stuff out. 346 minutes later. And this right here, ladies and gentlemen, is why I don't do hair collabs before it's time for me to go somewhere. Because... I am currently 30 minutes late and I have a 45 minute drive there. So technically over an hour late. Um, yeah. And the wig, it wasn't pre-plucked, pre-bleached. And I just thought I could wing it. And that was not a good idea. I didn't even end up doing the hairstyle that I wanted to do because I wanted to do something different than what the fuck I got on right now. It's side part. And it ain't even like a part side part. It's just like a flip over because I'm... I was pushing for time, but this is the wig, child, not ombre, trying to come back, but it's cute, it's cute or whatever, but let me go ahead and leave, I'm wasting more time sitting here talking, I'm trying to make sure I got everything, I think I had already didn't put everything in to the side already, so I could just walk out the door, so let's go. Okay, they ain't playing, they got the decor going, 
<laughs> and everything. This is cute. Yeah. Who is cold? like nine o'clock it's um it's 12 22 i haven't done nothing but laid in the bed you know nothing at all i just laid in the bed now i'm up and i'm hungry i'm about to eat my food from last night i got the chicken in the air fryer i just need to warm up these meatballs and jambalaya i should have made me more than one plate but i still got that pizza from yesterday too so i might eat that um i'm gonna eat that pizza later Oh, we my stomach is hurting, bro. Hold on. Y'all, I'm finna be champagne out, child. My mama bought me this big box of champagne. It's four big ones. <laughs> and it's 40 small ones. Oh, and I got two other small ones right there, girl. All this champagne. And I bought that uh, Easter Ray champagne yesterday, girl. We about to be litty like a titty over here. Love me some champagne, bro. Oh, and while we was um in St. Thomas, the candle sale was going, and I had them forgot or whatever. So I had to tell my, I had to tell my mama like, oh, you going to Bath and Body Works, girl? You going? Let me know. I only got two candles though. It's so crazy because like you would think like with the candles only being ten dollars, you would get a whole bunch, but I never really get a lot. I only get I only get two. The max I probably ever got was six, and if I'm being honest, I still haven't used all the ones that I got last year. Like. I got two sitting right. One of them I use as decoration. And I got two sitting outside that sofa. But this is my favorite. I think I tell y'all this all the time. This is my favorite, favorite, favorite scent from Bath and Body Works. It's rose water and ivy. I feel like it's kind of like an acquired smell. Like most people wouldn't really like it. But I love it. Like, oh my gosh, it smells so good to me. Like, I got a plug in right now with that scent. It smells so. I'm about to like this right now. Oh, it smells so good. And y'all, why did I forget to put the rubber bands back on last night? I woke up, I thinking that I had them in, 
But when I had like yawned, I realized that they wasn't in. I was like mid yawn. I was like, fuck. <laughs> How did I forget to put them back in last night? I was like, damn. I had like, as soon as I realized it, I got up and put them back in, child. Because I just be playing. I be playing too many games. I really need to get to editing. I haven't posted a video in about two, three days. But honestly, I technically... Them three days was really in that one vlog, if I'm being honest. Because St. Thomas vlog was three days. So today will be the third day. Or the fourth day. So I need to post today. So I really need to get the editing. But I kind of want to chill. I said I was going back to the store today. I don't even know if I'm going to do that, child. If it was anything like yesterday, I ain't trying to go nowhere. I'm thinking about ordering, like, online. And doing, like, pick up at the mall. to see, Like, that, that might work for me. That way I'm, like, in and out. You know, like, in and out. Mm-hmm. Now that's what I'm talking about.